six and wait until you hear about this book. The title, Dad, You Don't Work, You Wrestle. And if you're a wrestling fan, you know this guy, George South, here with us today. Good to see you. Thank you so much. Tell Thank me about you. the title of the book first. Well, you know, many, many years of traveling, packing the bag, getting ready to go on the road. And, uh-huh. uh, many years ago, one of my twins, Abigail, uh-huh. uh, was just jumping on the bed, making all kind of noise, and I hollered at her, you know, uh, Abigail, be quiet. Daddy's got to go to work right? on the bed. Of course, she said, Dad, you don't work. You wrestle. <laughs> so uh, I've got to give her credit for that. <laughs> That's so great. She, she did that. And what a great picture on the front. I love that. Thank you. Talk always always got my mouth open. <laughs> always yelling. Hey, we talking. know you. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> Talk about that picture. When you look at that picture, what does that make you think of? Well, that was one of our very, very special nights. We brought a bunch of the old NWA Mid-Atlantic legends together for one huge show in Spartanburg. And uh, that was a picture taken that night. Uh, I was in the ring then with the Rock and Roll Express. I uh-huh. know a lot of the fans remember those guys. That's right. And... Um, just a special picture, a special book, and just a lot, a lot of great, great memories. Yeah, I was looking through some of the pictures here, and you really have. I mean, there are so many pictures here that real wrestling fans are going to absolutely love, and it's all kinds of people in here. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, you know, Nature Boy Rick Flair, great, great friend of yeah. mine, Ricky Steamboat, Paul Jones, Wahoo McDaniel. The list can go on and on, and uh, uh, just had a great, great blessed career. The good Lord's been so good to me, mm-hmm. and uh, still doing it. Still in the ring, and got a little training school in Charlotte, and uh, still got my hand in the middle of trying to keep up with those young guys <laughs> i bet you do just fine talk a little bit about what is in the book what will people learn when well they the read most it? important thing is and what's so amazing is uh i just so much good has happened mm-hmm. in uh, 31 years of professional wrestling uh met all of my heroes and got to hang out with them and uh that's in there it's just a lot of happiness a lot of great stories a lot of stuff on the kids and just trying to, you know, be a pro athlete, pro wrestler, and, and raise kids. A lot of people think that we're not normal. <laughs> you know, they think that you don't uh, yell at the kids. Right. You don't drop them off at school. And, and just a lot of that in there. The, the biggest response is uh, the first person that bought the book read it, and they said, well, we got a problem. They said, there's nothing sad in <laughs> here. And I said, oh, my goodness. You won't find that in there. Just Aww. a lot of happiness, a lot of great, great stories. Was it easy to write a book or hard to write a book? Oh, it was very hard. Yeah. Uh, especially for me. I just took notes and... Uh, wrote on napkins in the back of a popcorn box. And uh, uh, so Mark James, who did the book, I, he, what a blessing. I just gave him everything, and he just he made something great out of it. Now, where can people get it? Because they're going to want to get their hands uh, on it. Easiest thing in the world, go to georgesouth.com. Uh, my website, uh, it'll take you right through each step, and uh, I'll bring it to your house if you want me to. I'll bring <laughs> no, it right to you. So. You shouldn't say that. You're going to be going to a lot of houses. <laughs> I know that. So thank you so much. It's doing great. Dad, you don't work, you wrestle. Very, very cool title, George. Thanks for coming in this morning well, and sharing the so book much. with us. It's we always appreciate so great it. to be here. Thank you. Yes, coming up after the break, product testing, a knife sharp.